everybody. I just thought I'd get on here and review this little wig I got. This wig, I've already unboxed her and everything. So, let me get my eyeballs on so I can see what I'm doing here. And let me adjust you a little bit. Uh, okay, there you go. So, this is from the wig shop. You see that? And it's this is Zelda. She's color 1822. And uh, yeah, there you go. Now, she's like a little beachy wig. She was really shiny. I have uh, I put some of this in her hair in her. This is a, a dry shampoo. It does say uh, brunette, but it, it doesn't really color it. But she was really shiny, so I'm like, no, I got to put something on her. And her bangs were kind of long on me, so I kind of made her here at the side a little bit, if you could see. But she has really nice color. It's kind of this blonde, is it like a sandy blonde, I guess. She's got like, looks some, like some brown in here. But she's a little beachy waves, little, you know. And she has the permatease up here. And it seems like the permatease comes pretty around here, you know, at the top. But yeah, she's a light little wig. Um, a nice little wig for summertime. I thought she'd be a little small for me. And, you know, it seems like they're kind of fall, far back. But... Uh, she comes down pretty far back here. Her, the, the webbing in here is pretty, uh, stretchy. So that might be a factor. And I did kind of trim this a little bit because it was just hanging in my eyes. And, you know, we don't really care to have that in our eyes. <laughs> well, I don't. But this is how she looks. She's just like a little bob, and let me see if I could get back, let's see if we can see the side view. And let me try to turn, this is a good exercise to stretch your back, so. And, oh, she all sticking up up there. So here's the other side. And let me see if I can get to the back on this side a little bit. So you can see a little bit how she looks. Uh, okay, so yeah, she's, I like the little beachy waves. You know, I, I'm going to go home on vacation. And I wanted to take a couple wigs. And it's real humid back in Indiana. So it's nice to have a little something light on your head. You know, that's not going to be too heavy, even though you are sweating a lot. But, yeah, she's got the, like, the crisscross part. I kind of pulled her over this way more. You could, with that kind of crisscross area up here, I think you could kind of flip her back and forth the way you wanted her. Uh, so, yeah, this is the side, the way I decided to put her. And, uh, like I said, she's just a light, cute little wig to throw on. You know, they got to be separated there. The almost look like a, like I just took it out of the roller or something. So, it's, uh, versatile. Versatile. <laughs> so, I like it. I think it looks good on me. I mean, this is a wig I'll wear. Like I said, I just bought her from, uh, Paula Young. She was on clearance, so I don't know how long she'll be there. She had a few colors, I think, and I went with this uh, lighter color. Um, and I think she she was about $20, 20 dollars twenty nineteen ninety nine or something like that. Uh, I had it was a special going on. She's got the bendable ear tab. She's got the velcro in the back. Uh, it comes down pretty far in the back. I don't have a wig, wig grip on or anything because I think I still need to kind of do something with this bang. 
and I was kind of watching some videos. I have another wig that I dyed purple, tried to dry, dye purple, and my video is, uh, you guys have probably seen it already. I was trying to cut that one a little bit. It, you know, you watch people cut it, and but when you go to do your own, it's like, oh no. And, uh, but yeah, she she needs to be cut right here. But we'll get her going, you know. She, you just get that permatease working. And let's see if she's not so bad hanging in the face. Then she kind of perks up there and uh, she moves good. She feels good. So, yeah, I think this will be a nice little summer wig for me when I go on vacation to where you like them. Uh, I was watching one girl, and, you know, she kind of teases them up a little bit, you know. Gets them, she works in, works in there and gets stuff going. Now, this side, like I said, is, this is just water. Uh, I had a tip about just spray water on it and work it like that, you know. Try to activate those little beachy waves more. It kind of helps, you know. You know, this is the kind of wig you can play with it. I mean, I like it that I flipped it over this way. I love this side. It looks so nice. This side, you know, maybe I have to put it behind my ear on this side. You know. A little, a little cattail. Maybe that's how she needs to go, you know, behind one ear. And This is Zelda. She's on the clearance from Paula Young, and it's the wig shop. So I don't know, you know, how long they'll have them when they're in clearance like that. And, you know, sometimes you're only limited to certain colors when it's marked down. Yeah, I think she's a cute little wig. Very cute. Like I said, she's really airy. She's light. And that's what I like. I, I mean, it doesn't even feel like I have you know, a wig on, on my head. I don't have, like I said, I don't have a wig grip on or nothing. So I'd probably have to uh, wear a wig grip just for the purposes of, you know, trying it on right now. I don't have a wig grip on. And there's the color again. It's this, she's this uh, blonde, pretty blonde. Like I said, it could, Maybe considered a sandy blonde. I'm not really sure. You know, when they just have a number here, you would have to look it up and actually see what color those n numbers represent. Zelda with me on vacation. You know, I can wear a headband. It's uh, light enough. I can wear a hat. But usually if I have my hair fixed, I don't wear a hat. I would call it a sandy blonde because it's got like that sandy, like you're at the beach with a little highlight of blonde, you know, on the tips. You know, that's where your hair gets light is on the ends around your face. Uh, you know, so that's kind of what they've done. They've kind of do some whiter colors around the face. But yeah, she's cute. I could have wore this to my uh, sister's uh, 1920s party that we had at Christmas. So I'll have the details down below. Like I said, she's, uh, you know, a little bob from Wig Shop because it's very stylish that you can work with it. You know, even these little wisp of hair in the front, I can still work with them. You know, it's not like they're terrible. So usually your hair is usually like that. I know mine is. I have one good side, one bad side. So I just wanted to get on here and review this little wig for you guys. Show you what I got. She'll be going with me on vacation, so I'm sure you'll see me wearing her. All right, guys. I'll see you later, alligator. Bye.